Well, we have a couple more CDs left to get. So, we gotta fucking go to this one, and you might see them sparkles off to the side, so... Let's pull out Rush Search, see if he can find it. There you go, kiddo, and you tell me if you get anything. Give me a bark. Oh, you silly dog, that wasn't a CD. Nothing, let's be serious though, nothing smells worse than wet robot dog. But we got our CD, no questions asked. And I'm not positive if I mentioned earlier, but if those little toy soldiers kind of attack you, they'll wriggle bolts out of you until you wiggle free. They don't do any damage, which is kind of cool. You can do a no damage run if you really wanted to. Um, I, I, I don't do them ever. I've tried to do them before. Ended pretty poorly and a lot of shattered dreams and depression. I'm still on Zoloft for it. It's awesome. So the moral of the story is that, like, if you want to be depressed, just fucking try and beat a game that you're not very good at and take very much damage. Rush, if you fucking fall off that platform, I'm gonna jump off and save you. But you got the CDs, so we're all good. Now those CDs were fucking cool, they were great, they were awesome. Well, every stage has to have one annoying CD. Here's the one in Magic Man stage. Fucking, I, I don't know, you probably saw those sparkles, they're like right underneath where I am. Now I'm gonna try and kill this little guy first. And you might think, oh, okay, well then that'll solve the problem. Well, no, because from a gameplay standpoint, if you killed that thing, it wouldn't break the blocks for you. So, they have to infinitely respawn, which is fucking annoying, because you have to have Rush out there, and you don't- You dickhead! I don't- I'm not great at organizing this fucker to stay where I want him to, and he always goes and he hits Rush. But I got the CD- oh, oh, you're not getting the fucking CD now, buddy. I got it. You shit face. And I believe- oh, yeah, I didn't know there were two up there. Oh, well. What are you gonna do, you know? I see the sparkles up there, though. It's on the far left. And... Hopefully we can just wait for them to fucking kill themselves. I'm not gonna fall prey to your trick again, I fought. Alright. Come on, Rush. Oh, I'm, you're not gonna get it at that rate, are you? I need to put him more over to the left, don't I? Yep. That's what I thought. He tried. No. Fuck it. Um, that's what I'm telling you, though. Like, the. It's really fickle about where you put it to get the CDs. I don't know. Maybe. That's. Just fucking shitty. Now, I don't know, I probably shouldn't get that CD, that, well, I have better things to do, like get more CDs, that one's stupid. Oh man, I don't think there are any CDs on this screen, so, you've already seen this, so just tell me about your day, how are you guys doing? Really? Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, it's terrible. It, for three weeks, huh? Well, I mean, you know, you, you gotta do everything that you can. I'm sorry to hear that, like, well, you, you know what, you don't have to yell at me about it, I'm just trying to help. I don't understand, I don't understand why you're treating me like I'm a scapegoat for your problems, because that's not, oh, there's a CD, hold on just a second. I'm gonna fucking try and get that before the train comes and hits me. Rush! Get the CD! Oh, sweet. Okay. Try again. You got Mulligan. Perfection! Oh, fuck. Bad time. Taking damage, it's tolerable as long as you get your CDs out of it. You know what I'm saying? Ugh, fuck. God, this stage is not that much fun. It's... It, this is a good game. I just don't really care for the Magic Man stage. It's not my favorite. I think, I don't know what my favorite stage in this game would be. Now, I saw some sparkles over there, so I'm think. wait, is that the right spot to use it? No, I don't think that's what it is. Of course, oh, the little guy's got soot all over his face. Ow, fuck you, spike platform dick. And, there's a CD. Now, I'll wait for the spikes to move, Christ forbid, ow. Oh. Yeah, just fucking kill me, whatever. 
Now, I know that I have enough lives to get them out the wazoo the other stage, so... Might as well just fucking slide around and get a bunch of CDs. If I got a game over, I'd be pretty pissed, because I got like half the CDs and I don't want to go through the level again and bore everyone. Ugh, lordy. And, okay, jump. Now, don't jump, and then jump when he hits the bell. Hit the bell. Hoppity- oh, fuck. At least they're not instant kill spikes, that'd be really fucking mean. If, I don't know, I've noticed that there aren't a bunch of spikes in this game, really. Just fucking hits and difficult enemies and annoyances. Uh-oh, I see- oh, f get out of here, you jerks. I saw some sparkles, though. That's a good cue for Rush to come over here and do his thing. You gotta kinda use- you have to hear- Yep, he got- or no, I was gonna say you have to hear if he actually dug the, the CD out, but you can kinda see the sparkles come out when he digs it up. Since no Magic Man, we're gonna go over to Tengu Man stage next. Maybe get a bunch of new CDs. Maybe we can learn all about Robot Masters, what makes them tick. It almost makes me feel guilty for reading the profiles beforehand, but I, I wasn't thinking ahead, so... Because I started doing the profiles in, like, Mega Man 2 or something. Yeah, yeah, actually, that's quite correct, I just remembered. Mega Man 2 was when I did the profiles, and that was a fucking long time ago. Now it's, like, Mega Man Base. That's six or seven games afterwards, dog. I don't know where you'd place Mega Man in Base. But interestingly enough, this game, in its data, when it refers to Mega Man base by a number, that's not going to get rush, you got to go through that kid up. When you look up the data, it doesn't call this game Mega Man 9 or anything like that. Rush, it's a worm. It doesn't call this game Mega Man 9, is what I'm saying. It calls it Mega Man 8.5, which is a pretty reasonable number if you're looking at this game, because this is fucking 8.5, that's what this is. So it makes me wonder, though, if they had Mega Man 9, like, if they were thinking of doing it for a while, but they didn't really get into it or something. I don't know. I don't know why I'm speculating something that I don't know or care about that much. Ah, a CD. That's something I care about, man. These CDs are very important to me. If I don't get all of them, well, I'd just feel silly. Nada boy. You made up for your fucking triple mistake on that last one. Haha, -ha, what? I was gonna look so cool, I had a wall blocking his shots. It was like we were playing army, and I was winning, but I didn't. Fucking. Whatever. I don't like any fucking enemies that damage me. What, like, that ruins the time I have in a game. But you want to do- you do want to take this lowest route, or else you're going to miss this CD, and every CD is important. Like, fucking... I don't know, every bone in your body is important. You have to have all of them, or else you fucking... You won't be able to show off to a bunch of dorks. I don't even understand anymore. I'm totally running out of shit to say with these stages. Well, that's great, I mean, it's not like I'm gonna fucking play my gun with somebody else, but... Anyways, since I am kind of fucking just sick of getting hit by stupid clown cars, fucking get out of here. These metools had enough of you too. Come here, come here. Get over here, jerk. Come on, open your face. Oh, shit. I'm overexerting myself, I'm getting too proud. What do you think you're doing, Tellies? You're not touching this dog. He's a good dog. You have no right. But yeah, since I am kind of getting a little, like, boring, probably, I don't know. I don't know what you guys think. I feel like I'm not up to snuff. So, if anyone, like, I don't know, this is fucking gay, but if anyone wants to, like, ask me a question and wants me to answer something, just leave a fucking comment asking a question I can answer questions. Next video or something. This is silly. Okay, just do that. 
And I'm gonna be fucking so embarrassed because I'm gonna get like two questions and one of them's like, how many cocks can you fit in your mouth? And then the other one's gonna be like, you're a faggot. And I'll just be like, what a brutal time to be alive. And I see that underneath you, Sniper Joe. Fucking gonna get... Come on, enough, enough. There. Now let's dig underneath his feet, see what we got. That was way too far over. I don't know what the fuck I was thinking. Rush. It's okay. You made a mistake because I placed you a little off center. I think this should be it. Usually I just put his nose wherever the sparkles were. And that's typically all you gotta do. And yeah, no tiny man, yada yada yada. Uh, save. I don't know how many CDs we have now. Maybe I can check. And I fucking lost a bunch of bolts. But I can still buy shit if I really want to. Like, I could buy that, uh, stupid friggin' energy refiller. Alright, how many we got? 65, that's a good number. It's a nice, even number. Kinda. Fucking wind man, I saw him again. Well, who are you? Who are you supposed to be? Fuck you. Shitty wind man and Mega Man 2 Robot Masters. But anyway, yeah, ask a question if you want to. We'll get we'll do another one, I'll catch you later.